Hello everyone, I'm here to talk about VMix and I just recently found out about VMix so yeah it's basically the equal to uh, OBS Studio or maybe it's better I, I really don't know yet uh, I've got the free version here um, there are other paid versions that are I guess better, you know. I'm setting it up, going through the process. Let's see what we got. Just leave it the way it is for now, I don't know. It's taking a nice little minute to load up and set up. I'm definitely interested in knowing but all does it have to offer compared to um, OBS and how I'll be able to use it to do any kind of streaming or broadcasting or recording or whatever, you know. I just want curious to know what it has to offer. Man. <laughs> You know how it is when you first set something up and yeah, it's taking a while to load up. I mean, it took a nice little minute to download. Um, I want to say it's um, it was like 300 and maybe even more. Like, it was already like a half a gig, you know what I'm saying? Maybe, maybe 400, 500. Uh, megabytes that's that's a pretty big size file you know roughly about half of a, a gig and when when like I say the more the more space something takes up on your computer software wise the the longer it takes to load up, the longer, you know. Let's see, check out this here format that it has. Y'all still with me? Man, it's taking me uh, all over the map. I don't, I don't know what's next. As you can see, you can go to vmix.com and I'll check that out later. Right now, I'm just trying to jump into this B mix. Because I have already, I have OBS, and I have OBS, I mean, Streamlabs OBS. And I, for my editing software, I use. I use Flamora, Flamora 9, and right now I'm using a thing called Screenomatic, Screenomatic, or whatever. There's like so many different programs you can use, and that you probably, you know, you probably have to use to download, or whatever, whatever, so. When it comes down to making YouTube videos or streaming or whatever it is you're trying to do, just realize there is a lot of stuff out there that you're gonna need. I have Serato DJ on here. I have Virtual DJ on here. I even have Rekordbox on here, I think. If you're, not, if you're familiar with that. I also have Audacity on here. It's a free um, audio recording software. I have uh, iTunes on here. Like I say, at the end of the day, there's so many different, so many different softwares that you uh, that you download on your computer, don't even realize it to the point where you know. 
you never know what you're gonna need, you never know what you're gonna use, so make sure that you have everything that you need. And with all that being said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll till next time. Hello YouTube world, welcome to my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I drop hot content like this. And stay tuned for the next video.